What's up, everybody? This is Casey here with the Buckner Group, and I am here with Lehman Griffin of hey guys. GHS, and out here today just to kind of learn a little bit about you and uh, what you do. So, All right, yeah. so I know we were talking earlier, what got you started in the business? So I did this a couple years ago, well, a couple, 2012 with my yeah. brother, and uh, we did pretty good at it and kind of uh, got me to where I understood the business a little better, and, and uh, that didn't work out. You know, they say never get into business with family. Yeah. But so I got back into the real world and got a real job. And um, I did robotics for a while. And cool. my wife and I just decided one day that we wanted to, I, I did some side work yeah. and decided, you know, let's see if we can make this full time. And it got busier and busier. And um, last year, a year ago, this month or last month, October, I decided to just give it a shot yeah. and see what happens. Cool. And, <laughs> and the it, rest was is history, it was scary. It was scary. Yeah, it was definitely a risk. Um, yeah, so what all, uh, I guess, what all, tell about what all you do. So I guess I classify myself as a handyman, but I'm kind of a, uh, I wouldn't call myself a home builder or a general contractor. I don't yeah. do jobs that large, but I kind of fill in the gap from a lot of the problem in the construction industry is these customers, they feel like they don't have a big enough job. Right. Like, oh, I don't want to call you out here for this. It's just so small. It's not worth your time. Yeah. So I've, um, that's kind of the, um, that's kind of the area that I felt was a, a need that needed to right. be filled. I started off doing just small jobs. Dryer vents was a big thing for me. Right. Yeah, um, I found a need that just a lot of people didn't even know about. Right. And then from there, it was, you know, what else do you do? Mm -hmm. And so I started kind of defining uh, my category. Yeah. And really, it's just odd jobs, miscellaneous, honey-do list. Uh, I work with a lot of realtors um, and do uh, inspection reports for yeah. selling houses and things like that. And I, uh, I do decks, deck repair. Cool. Just Kind of a little yeah, bit. Yeah, I of saw everything. one that y'all did. I guess recently, a big old. I guess you redid the whole. Took all the flooring up. Yeah, that's a that's a, a popular misconception. That's... People think their deck is completely ruined, and most of the time, it's just the decking. Yeah, the structure's fine. So we uh, that one was in Chelsea. Actually, we cool. we ripped up the whole decking and uh, the framework. We we did some bracing just to support it better. Yeah. Uh, and they came in with all new decking, and it, right. it looked really good, actually. Yeah, yeah. and that's like, like what you said. It's better to have somebody that knows what they're doing where you had somebody else that was just trying to sell. dishonest or something. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. they would have ripped yep. the whole thing out. I tell people all the time, I'm like, this probably isn't good for me, but I don't right. think you need that. Right. <laughs> it hurts my budget, but Yeah, this is not out, helping so, me at all. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, I'd rather – my thing is – there's no such thing as a customer that's better than another customer. Right. It's all about just helping them because their job, even though it may not be the most important to me, it's the most important to me. Right. So, you know, right. and that might lead to a bigger job down the future. Yeah. Or it might lead to them just saying, hey, I like this guy. He did a really good job and right. they give my number to somebody else. Yeah. So, um, it, it's worked really well for me. I think I've tried to develop a relationship with my customers. And, yeah. Um, I think I've done good at it. Yeah. So. All right. So, how can people find you? So the best way to reach me is my telephone. It's uh, area code 205-641-3273. Uh, if you're on Facebook, you can search for me on Facebook, GHS Birmingham. And the GHS stands for Griffin Handyman Services. Uh, you can also email me at ghsbirmingham at gmail.com. Any of those three methods will work fine. Um, I text also if you feel comfortable texting me, you don't have time to call. Uh, anytime you can reach me. So, and if somebody wants to get a cool shirt, yeah, if you want to get a cool like shirt, that, I like that color. <laughs> you know, somebody said something about this earlier at the bank. Yeah. They were like, that color works. I know, perfect. it looks good. So when I saw it, I was like, I gotta have it. Yeah, that's good. Well, it was great meeting you, meeting up with you, and uh, we'll make sure we'll have plenty of business in Vegas. I appreciate so, it. Down